Blokes like that go on forever. They pickle, so they last longer. No, blokes like that just go burst and they get pickled, crystallised. When they freeze in, they have a whiskey-flavoured ice dolly six foot long. That's about all that was worth, to tell the truth. Wow. You've got to feel sorry for him now, haven't you? Yep, we don't. No one else will. What hey, Mum? Heard about old Edge, have you? I should have given her a right coating. Who? Oh. Sue, in the cap. Too much to say for herself. She adds too much altogether. Well, she ain't backwards in coming forwards, is she? She's so you love. And how he puts up with it sometimes. Hypocrite. Me. He's lived round here all my life, I don't know. Oh, you and Sue have had words, have you? About old age. Least if I lived in the same house, I'd feel a twinge or something. She acts like she don't give a monkeys. Well, maybe she don't. I mean, all rest to me was three pound a king Edwards a week, plus the occasional cox. I mean, if you look at that from a business point of view. He says that to annoy me, doesn't he? Community spirit went out the window when the Tories come in. It's uneconomic. I'm not talking about economic. I'm talking about when nobody had two acres to rough together. When you didn't have any money, nobody else did neither, and you was all in the same bloody boat. When I had a boat, son. Oh, Pete, pack it in. I'm not talking about the vote, I'm talking about the people. It's all strangers now, even the people you know. Hypocrite, me? Ma'am. I'm the only bugger who cares. Ma'am, I'm sorry. Don't let it get you down. Ma'am. Ma'am, well, what's wrong with Paulie then? I mean, why was she around the docks? Well, tell me, would she? There's another one who deserves a coat and an all. Too soft, I am. Turn to an end, I can tell you. Hey, Bobs. What are you doing here? I'll come and get me dinner money. There you go, darling. All right. Here we are. Thanks, Mum. You mean your mother name first, then, son? I'll leave it out. Dan, I'm playing Mark on the machines. That money's meant to pay for your dinner. I'm playing with my own money. All right, thanks, yeah, you know what I fancy? Swift Dale, the then's anniversary. Oh, yeah. All right, then, Swift Point. Your mum's in there. So? So I thought you wanted to enjoy yourself. She ain't that bad, Kat. She's got a good heart somewhere. Oh, yeah. Go on, go. I'll manage. All right. Look out like the lob. Oi. Here. Yeah. There ain't nothing wrong with Paulie, is there? Nah. She told us, wasn't she? Got yeah. one brought out. No. Say it for your mum. For that good art she's got. Somewhere. No red shrank milk, did you? I thought he was allergic to it. Oh, if it weren't for him not collecting his milk, he'd still be lying there. Makes you think, doesn't it? I'm thinking. Thinking of what? No need for that tone, so. Reg weren't our neighbour any more than he was yours. I mean, what were you doing while he was up there, eh? You tell me that and then you can tell me. I never said anything like that. No, but that's what you meant. I never had anything like that in mind. No, no, you bloody beals. What's the matter with you? You want to control your missus, Ali? He's soft enough to take it, he is. You lot, neighbours. First chance you get, you can't wait to point the finger. Well, for a start, Miss Silkney, because you don't even bloody well live on the square, so what's it got to do with you? And for a finish, you can tell Marville that we ain't going to take the blame. Well, I would have said your tea was that bad, would you, Ali? Well, if you don't like it, you get your rolls elsewhere. And we'll do the same with our spuds. And keep your hands off my old man. Oh, I see you put your spuds before your old man. I want to put them about the same level myself.